Yo, what up, Hosh fam? Uh, today I want to talk to you guys how about how to use um, make a montage on metal. Uh, it's super easy. There's a couple different ways to do it. Uh, before I get into that, um, if you guys don't know what metal is, it's a game clipping software for a PC. Uh, there's even an app you can use on your phone to post to Instagram or anything, Twitter. It just makes it super easy. Uh, it's a great software, so I would definitely check it out. I also have a guide to how to set up and use metal uh, that I'll post in the description below. Uh, super helpful. Anyway, so let's get to the video for the montage. So there's a couple of different ways you can make a montage on metal. One of those ways is it post to metal. You should see up here on the top right. You'll see post to metal. Uh, you can click new montage for that. And then once you click that, you can pick whatever videos you want to do. So if I just wanted to do these two, I'd click those two. It says montage one clips continue to create montage. Another way to do that is if you just come over here to your video, videos in your library, I just click a couple videos here. No, not that, D click uh, here, Let's just do these two. And then it says down here at the bottom, what are you gonna do with these two clips? It says montage two clips, boom. All right, so once you click the uh, montage button here, you get to kind of do some uh, fun features with your clips. Uh, let's just say I'm in this clip right here. Um, you can edit some stuff into it. If you wanted to, you could ch chuck in some text or whatever. Um, you could change the color of stuff. You could, I mean, literally so much stuff. You can change the stroke, normal background fill, anything like that. Um, I throw a text, um, the text element in here. I can literally type something and I can chuck it around wherever I want. This is how you move this. You can move it around to however you want. You could rotate it. I rotate it upside down if I wanted to. Anything like that. You can move it around. You can make it bigger. Ooh, like I could just make that pop up. So let's just say that. And let's just say I want to move it over to 30 seconds into my clip. Or how about, how about this? We'll move it to the beginning of the next clip. So like right here. Okay. And we know where it's going to pop up because we just selected it, right? So we put, so let's just go over here to the video. Move this over. I can press play. Boom, we can go, I mean, go a little farther. Just watch me botch some shots. So boom, pops up I love you with the text that I have. It's pretty cool. It's super easy to get rid of as well. So you can just go down here to the bottom. Let's just pause this real quick. Go down here to the bottom, you can just delete. Boom, done, made an error, anything like that. You can always adjust it if you click on that again, or you can add more than one. You can also add GIFs, which is pretty cool. Um, I don't know, there's some random stuff. So I can check this in here, right here. Uh, pop it up in the middle of the screen if I did something silly. So if I was just like, oh my gosh, whatever you want to do with it. Uh, you can do all kinds of gifts. You can make it last. You can literally make it last. So down here at the bottom, you have how long you can select it to last for, um, which is super helpful. So I can make it last like, I mean, hardly, hardly at all. But let's see if we play it. Right there. So boom, it pops up on the left side of the screen, which is, was kind of a meme because you're not supposed to take this vehicle in this game. It's kind of funny. But um, right there, then it's gone. Or I can make it last like literally for the full clip if I really wanted to. So delete. Uh, another really cool feature I love is add music. You can add your own music. Um, there's There's been some issues off and on with um, some metal stuff and people adding their own music to it, but there are a lot of support things on metal.tv support. Uh, you can check that out or feel free to leave a comment below or if you have any questions. I usually look some stuff up or I'll answer your questions as soon as I can. But let's just say I wanted to add some music. So let's go to dance. Let's do for dance. Let's say I want to hear a preview of what it sounds like. So let's listen to this. I mean, that sounds pretty cool. So let's just say I want to add it. So now back here, if I'm in this side, this part of the clip at the bottom, this music's playing. That music's playing there and I can select how far I want it to go or I can move it around to a different part of the clip. So now it's gonna pick up the song, which is super nice. So I, I mean, I always enjoy that feature. Uh, you can have more than one song. Obviously, if I have a five and a half minute clip, I probably need more than one song. These are all copyright free, I believe. So you can use them for all your clips if you're posting anything like that, uh, which is awesome. Uh, just kidding. And so you can name your montage. I mean, I don't know, Destiny Madness. I'll, I'll name it right here. You can add people. So if you wanted to, you could just tap it. I can search somebody that I have as a friend. Um, I'm not even on here that like 
like that much. I don't share a lot with my buddies, but I'll post on Instagram, stuff like that. You can add tags. Uh, it's a great way to, um, if you're just starting as a streamer, just want to post content or see more, more people to see it, something like that, like a meme or something awesome. There's such an awesome metal community. So you can post it, throw some hashtags in there. And then it, if you're following the hashtag on the main page, on the home page, then you, you'll see that content. Uh, you can also share the clips if you're connected with on your PC or whatever, or on your phone. Discord, Twitter, Reddit, Tumblr, super easy. Uh, they don't have uh, Instagram or anything available. I post a lot on Instagram for my metal clips. Uh, so that's why I have it on my app, an app on my phone for metal. And I just upload it on there, super easy. Um, which is awesome. You can make it unlisted if you wanted to. So hidden, uh, hidden from your public profile, it can only be seen by sharing the link. So that's kind of nice if you don't want other people to see it. Uh, then this will also be public. So you can share with two followers, anyone following you or, uh, or just anyone that can, that can see it or what views your profile. So if you guys come over and view my profile, how she's you guys can see everything that I posted public, which is everything. <laughs> so, um, so it's awesome. So then when you're done with the clip, Let's just say we wanted to do something like this. We've got this all refined, whatever, how we want it. We click save edits. So once you hit that save edits button, you can upload the clip. It says you can upload more than two minutes. That's just because of a setting that I have, but you can change that. Uh, but then it's gonna upload for you. You just have to wait till it's done uploading, then it's posted public. You can share it, you can do whatever you want with it. You can save it again, post it to YouTube, whatever you wanna do. Uh, but anyways, guys, that's how you make a montage on Metal. It's super easy. You can even, there's some more features you can play around with and have fun with, but it's a great way to post things. Um, so I hope this video helps you guys out. If it did, hit that sub button, hit turn on notifications. There will be more videos on Metal without a doubt. And I post some ga some gameplay stuff too. Uh, feel free to check me out on Twitch. I'll be posting in the description below and follow my Instagram. Anyways, I love you guys. If you have any questions or concerns or comments, or if you like the video, uh, feel free to let me know in the comments below. Uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much.